23 new immigrants to Tropico. At least we're gonna have people to enter the workforce now. Hopefully, you know, they can start building stuff. Shit. Our president day for his remarkable 30 years of leadership. This is truly quite an accomplishment for any world leader. Indeed. There we go. 30 years. Oh, uh, this killed two people and destroyed one electric substation. Oh, okay. Breaking news! In case you haven't noticed, a huge hurricane has swept through tropical, leaving a trail of destruction in its path. In unrelated news. There are reports of people carrying a cauldron of tar and feathers traversing the island in search of the local meteorologists. The workers at the weather station were allegedly out drinking and therefore unable to issue a warning the day before the disaster. They want me to do a... Now the USSR said they want me to do military test... or nuclear testing. What, what? I... Environmentalist respect will be lowered permanently. I'll receive ten thousand dollars though. Yeah, let's do it. What's going on? The skies of Tropico were illuminated today by a fiery nuclear mushroom. Foreign experts have assured us that the light emitted after the explosion is not dangerous and is even good for the skin tone. <laughs> okay, well, I got ten thousand dollars after that nuclear ex nuclear testing. I can't seem to f see the actual mushroom cloud anywhere. Oh well. Oh, well, this irritating glow is still here. Someone wanted me to execute somebody. I don't even know. I don't know if I should. I can do this. Arrange an accident. The secret police can arrange an accident for somebody eliminating. Um, oh, okay. I can kill somebody, but their respect towards me will be lowered. I don't know if I really want to do that. Muy buena. It doesn't seem like the best idea. This guy lives in a mansion. I'm still bringing plenty of new immigrants to Tropico, trying to make sure, um... I still have people to work. Where the hell are my builders? What the fuck are they doing? No more Teamsters. Hopefully they can ferry people a little bit faster. But why are these builders just so goddamn useless? not doing anything apparently. They don't have any active projects even though there's several uh, buildings all around the island that need to be built desperately. They, they decided that it would be a lot funnier if they just kind of sat around and did nothing. Uh, where's El Presidente? What is it now? El, El Presidente. Apparently El Presidente can actually do a lot of stuff like he can uh, like he can make buildings build faster and, and Increased production in some places, so I'm gonna I'm gonna send him around. Where, where is good old Stalin? Here he is. Oh, I love, I love this guy. He looks like like uh, some dude said it. He looked like an Elvis slash Stalin, and I thought that was absolutely hilarious. Wonder how. Um, apparently, I can declare martial law. Apparently, it, it will destroy me, but 
I'm not. I don't think uh, starting uh, declaring myself dictator is a particularly good idea. I think that might end in end in tears for everybody. So uh, we'll decide against it. So what's something cool that I can build that I haven't built yet? Um, TV station, radio station. Electric substation, nightclub, restaurant. Industry. The windy season has started, and all tropicans with right minds are staying in the park. Yeah, I should build a drinking, furniture factory. Excluding those working, of course. For the others, listen to our station and relax. There is nothing better than the bad weather, as the prominent writer tells us. I want to build a bank, but I can't seem to find it. I keep saying I'm not gonna get, I'm not gonna build anything, but then I get bored. There's the bank. Cool. I should build it. A bank of El Tropico. If you know. Hey, we actually got builders. We're building the um. The uh, airport. Slowly but surely, they're building it. Where, where's El Presidente? What El Presidente, go over Are there and make boring? it so you know they'll build faster. Come on, build the airport. Come on, guys, you can do it. <laughs> oh no, oh no, the rebels are launching an attack. Special report. That new rebel fad has grown out of proportion. They are attacking buildings now. El Presidente stated he is shocked and appalled by this unprovoked attack on the peace and democracy in Tropico. <laughs> I got an army of 26 guys, and they're attacking this farm, and currently my army has mobilized like half of it. Right, right sitting next to this farm where a guard tower was waiting for them to attack, and the rebels have a mighty three troops to, to attack. <laughs> the whole army is here waiting for them. So, I'm not sure where the rebels are. I think they, they're gonna pre do a preemptive tactical retreat. Well, at least that would be best for them. Oh, here comes some more. More troops are being mobilized. Where are they? Where are those rebels? I'm not sure. I don't see if anything cool has been built yet. Why are my builders so, so useless? Oh, elections! Elections! A chance to impress them with my speech. I don't know. I'm pre doing pretty good. I'll address the environment. Uh, I'll praise the spirit of um uh, nationalists. And for my next mandate, I will make adequate housing. There we go. Hola, senores y senoras. The importance of the upcoming elections oh, here come the rebels. has brought me before you. We are one step closer to our goals. Victory is almost upon us, but we <coughs> must still push forward. 
I must warn you about the so-called oh, rebels oh. on our island. It was a massacre from us. Uh, destroyed them. Could not care less for this island, but present themselves as its liberators. Because of their nihilistic ways, all of our Are environmental efforts were ruined. Through my years of presidency, I have received your gratitude, my compañeros. Alas, I am nothing but a humble servant, and you are my masters, my employers. I have to pause and thank those who keep us strong together, the Tropica 